so here's the MKC2 liquid line solenoid valve coil. It's a dual voltage. You can use it for 120 or 240. Let's look on the bottom of the cover here. It shows you the two, the two different ways. And you can wire it either for 120 or 208, 240. So for 240 volt, you want to use, you put the red and the yellow together, right there. Red and yellow together, and you run power to your blue and power to your black by themselves. For 120 volts, you're going to have two wire nuts, and you put your blue and red wire together, and run power to those two, and then you put your black and yellow together, and run the other side power or neutral to that one. So this is how it would look if you have 120 volts coming in. You run either neutral or hot to either one of those. And this is how it would look if you had 240 volts or 208 and you want to run your power wires to the black and the blue and to do these ones together. Now since I have 208 volts coming into these two here, I'm going to put a wire nut on that for now. Take this wire, which is hot, I'm going to not touch it, but put tape on it. very carefully this one do the same take the wires off and not touching it tape up the hot lead I have to run it through this little metal hole right there. So I want it insulated well. Alright, so this is ready for me to safely pull it out. knockout on the right side and they hold those next to each other. See that it's there. So this one I want to take out. Just going to like so. Carefully put my hot leads that are insulated back through there. Run this little nut back on there. back on and then I want to make it I'll tighten that down So now I'm going to connect my black and my blue. But first I'm going to go ahead and put some electrical tape around this one. Now I'm going to mount my, my coil onto the valve, put the screw back on, And 
it's ready to receive power. So, take one side, it doesn't matter which one. All that matters is that I be careful. Cover. 